going on y'all this is travis from chasing anthems coming at you guys with another reaction video today we're gonna be checking out a band i got a recommendation for depeche mode ghost again uh video or song just recently came out i think the official music video did and these guys are going on tour again i can't believe it it has been a few minutes since i have uh, heard of Depeche Mode or thought of Depeche Mode or, you know, listen to any of their older stuff. But uh, since I got the recommendation, I said, yeah, we, we got to go check out and see what they're up to. Is it still the Depeche Mode of the past that we're aware of? Or is this a new era, a new phase of uh, their musical development and journey? I got no stinking clue, but I can't wait to check it out with you guys. With that being said, if you're new to the channel and you know what to do, please consider subscribing, hit the bell to be notified for the future videos, like, comment, share, do all the kind of good stuff, and then go check out original stuff. Chasing Anthems, I got links in the description box below, but wait till the video is done. Let me know all your thoughts, whether you like what I have to say or not. Put it down in the comment box. Let's roll. So far, it sounds very Depeche. Loving it. There you have it, Depeche Mode. <clears throat> I'm going to say something, that I, and don't take this the wrong way, but it sounds like a song that's already been written, meaning that it just feels like something that's already existed, um, which is their sound. Depeche Mode has that really iconic, electronic uh, you know, sound with the uh, consistent drive, just super steady. The really deep main vocals, you got the backup vocals, the higher rounds it out. It, 
I, you know, I don't know their arc or not their arc, their um, discog- discography, discography, whatever, their body of work as well to say that sounds like that song. But I can say that definitely sounds like Depeche Mode, old Depeche Mode, new Depeche Mode, all the same. Which is, if you're a fan, I would imagine that that's that's pretty exciting, right? That they they've stayed true to form. It's hard watching bands get older trying to chase the modern music or the new wave of things and new technology when you love them for who they were. So it's cool to see a band come out and say, you know, hey, we're still doing what we've always done. We still sound the way we sound and like us or not, but this is just what we do. So I really respect that. I think um, more bands that continue this long in their journey should fall in that suit. Not to say that you can't explore new boundaries, but you know, get the fans what they like. Give them, you know, give them the sound that um, that they're excited to hear, right? Um, the other thing is, I've been noticing there's a big trend, and we've been watching a lot of videos of like younger bands really emulating older bands and I could name a bunch of them but it doesn't really matter you the 70s and 80s sound is becoming more and more prominent in a lot of our uh, music that I think the newer younger generation is getting excited about so hey they say things come in like 30 year waves and you know don't throw away those jeans just yet because it you know just give it 30 more years and they'll be back in style as long as you can still fit in them. But hey, hey, with that being said, let me know what you think about the best mode. I think it's a great song. I think it is very indicative of their style and their and their vibe. And hey, do you. With that being said, I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.